Motu AVB interfaces are sophisticated devices that can be used in a variety of applications. This movie will explore how to use the interface for basic DAW recording and playback while monitoring through the DAW software. To help you get started, Motu has provided a number of preset device configurations. So the first thing we'll do is go to the preset browser in the device page of the Motu AVB control app. As you can see, the first listed preset is called Audio Interface. We'll choose that and hit Apply and OK. Because the presets are stored in the interface itself, it's also possible to call up a preset from the front panel of the interface. Press the Select button and turn until Preset is displayed. Press the button again to highlight the preset. Turn the knob if you want to select a different preset. Press the Select button one last time to activate the preset. The audio interface preset will enable all the audio inputs and outputs on the interface. The preset also enables inputs to the internal mixer, as well as inputs and outputs to the computer. In this movie, we're using the 1248 model as our example. If you have an 8M or 16A AVB interface, the available inputs and outputs will reflect the capabilities of that specific model. You can check the tech notes at the Motu website or even download the manual for each of these interfaces for further details. If we click on the routing tab, we see that all the interface inputs are routed to the computer. So in your DAW software, the available inputs will correspond to the assignments you see in the routing grid. These are direct assignments from the inputs to the computer, so that means no effects are in line with the input signals. If you do want to use the internal effects processing of the Motu interface on an input signal, you would change the assignment so that the signal going to the computer was coming from that internal mixer. The audio interface preset has already routed the interface inputs to the internal mixer of the interface. So all we have to change is the input assignment to the computer. So for example, I'll change the computer input assignment for channel one, which is the first microphone input to the mix return. Now if I apply any effects to channel one in the mixer, the mic input signal goes through the effect before it gets to the computer. The outputs from the computer are also directly assigned to outputs on the interface. As you can see, outputs one and two are routed to the main outs. Outputs three and four are routed to the monitor outs. Outputs five through 12 are routed to the eight analog outputs. Computer outputs 13 through 16 are routed to the two front panel phones as stereo returns. And the remaining computer outputs are routed to the digital outputs on the interface. This is how this preset works with the 1248 model. If you have an 8M or 16A interface, you'll see slightly different assignments based on the available I.O. of those models. And of course, you can change and customize these routings and then save a new device or routing preset for quick recall. Because the audio interface preset routes inputs and outputs directly to and from the computer, that means there is no internal direct monitoring in use inside the interface. This preset is appropriate if you are monitoring inputs through the computer, which is typical for the Pro Tools workflow, for example. In the next movie, we'll take a look at the interface and mixer preset, which is set up for direct input monitoring, taking advantage of the AVB interface internal mixer.